Greetings and salutations, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Twilight Princess. Uh, we had just gotten the bow, uh, and we're moving on into the uh, second half of the Goron Mines. Uh, I took the liberty of knocking down the bridge between episodes because uh, I was trying to start the next episode, but my recording software was being goofy. Or maybe I was being goofy. Someone was being goofy. Uh, but in any case, uh, it seems like we're back on track. All is good. Um, and these guys should be trying to murderize me, but they're not, and I can't remember why. Hello? Can you please be getting on with the killing, please? Hmm. There we go. Hello. Ah, dang it. All right. Easy game. Mm. <laughs> okay, it bothers me too. And then this will be the compass. Neat. Uh, I'm going to... Hold on. Okay. Uh, so there was a chest in, in that room before, but not, not where I thought it was. Uh, so we're fine. We can keep moving. Uh, that is in the room with the stamp under the water where the uh, bold ones were bad at shooting at me. Hello, sir. You look different than the others. Ah, you're here at last. I heard you might pay a visit, young human. I'm farsighted in all things. Here you go, the last key shard. Combine all three shards. You collected all three key shards and completed the big key. Hurry to the boss. If you use that key, you can open the room where Darbus, the tribal patriarch, is being held. Who knows how powerful Darbus is in his new grotesque form. But I suppose I could trust your power, considering you came this far. This far. Hurry right, now, to the patriarch's room. Sorry, I've forgotten what words are. Awesome. Thanks for the money. Oh, right. This one doesn't have a second level. Alright, well, we're making good progress. In fact, I don't know how much longer we're even going to have at this dungeon. Not too much longer, really. I, yeah, I get the picture, thank you. My god, it respawns really fast. Okay. Huh. 
Well, that went well. Awesome. These guys have a nice and high arrow drop rate. Thank you. Oops. Cool. Oops, no, nope, it's this one. Ugh. I should have killed this guy from below. Let's do that real quick. That is absolutely the correct perspective for Link, uh, but that doesn't mean that it doesn't unsettle me every time it just completely turns upside down like that. Cool. Nothing here, that's good. Some Deku tadpoles. Whoops. He just walked straight past me, but I'll take it. Dang it. Oh, woof. That was lucky, I mean skillful. recall how to get that treasure chest now that I think about it. Cool. Oh my goodness, they're everywhere. gonna say let's see if we can farm for arrows but uh, no need apparently yeah I gotta watch out for that my turn oh ah dang it that's fine we'll get arrows at oh, right here perfect idea thank you whoops um, I'm gonna switch these around because that's where I'm used to having my boots now uh, so the chest is way up there 
I don't know how to get to it. Wait, no, come back. Cool, there we go. In fact, now that I look at it, I don't even think we can get to it until we have the hook shot, or the claw shot. It's a claw shot in this one. It's a hook shot in the other ones. It's been a while since I've played this one, and I've played Majora's Mask in the meantime, so I'm all mixed up as to which one is which. And Skyward Sword, well, Skyward Sword has claw shots, though. I don't know. Me dumb dumb. Ooh! Uh. Hurry. There we go. Cool. Caught a fairy in a bottle. Yay! Okay. Fairies is good. Uh, it looks like aside from that one that we cannot get right now without the claw shot, uh, there aren't any more treasure chests. So, great! Let me just confirm real quick. Yes, indeed. Cool. Uh, do I plan to come back with the claw shot? No, I don't plan to come back with the claw shot. But uh, if there are enough people that would get mad at me if I don't, then I will. So, get mad at me in the comments if you want me to come back with the claw shot. Alright. And now for one of my favorite parts of this dungeon. It's a little thing, but it feels so satisfying. Just run at you in a straight line so you could just take them all out. <laughs> no! Oh, nuts. Oh well. Arrows? Arrows. Good. Alright. Darbus? We're not dealing with your average Goron anymore. He's finally realized the legend. He is Firus Twilight Igniter. Oh, shoot! Come on. 
please. I think I screwed it up. Oh, crap. There we go. Awesome. Well, it's not exactly optimal, but we're still doing well. Alright. I don't know how many jump slashes it takes to actually kill him. But I think... Uh... We'll, uh, we'll be able to finish him off this cycle. Well, this went well. Stab him in the eye brain. The metal head skull gem. Take a couple steps back there, Link. Guess it doesn't matter. <laughs> well done. We now have two few shadows. Hmm. You know, you've been very helpful so far, so as a reward, I'll tell you an interesting story. Zant. That's the name of the King of Darkness who cast this pall of shadows over your world. He's very strong. You would be nothing to him in your current state. But Zant will never be my king. I have nothing but scorn for his supposed strength. Not that your Zelda is much better. It still appalls me that this world of light is controlled by that princess. A carefree youth, a life of luxury. How does that teach duty? But I guess I shouldn't begrudge her the circumstances of her life. She didn't choose it, after all. I would never wish harm on her. No, as long as I can get my hands on a few shadows, I'll be just fine. Well, just one more left, shall we? <laughs> Let's shell, but give me a sec. How you feeling, buddy? Need some ibuprofen or something? You got a heart container! Yay! Uh, hmm? What am I doing here? My head. It aches. Let's see, so much pain, I cannot remember anything. All right. Well, we'll leave him here then. <laughs> Y'all done here? Yes, we are. He's a big boy. He can look after himself. And there's no more fuse shadow to touch, so he can't screw it up anymore. In retrospect, maybe I should have just finished this on the the last episode. Oh well, doesn't matter now. Heroic Aster. North of here, across the plain, past the Great Stone Bridge, in the lands guarded by the spirit of Nehru. You shall find one whom you seek. Thanks, Elden. Did, uh, did any of you hear that, or do I just stand here like an idiot? Esther. Call in. Don't stress yourself out, buddy. Ilya. Got to save Ilya. Yeah, that's where I'm headed, actually. That's what the Light Spirit was saying. Those monsters left me with the other kids, but they must have taken her somewhere else. Whenever I thought I couldn't go on, I would think of you and Elia and hold on, Aster. Oh, that's cute. It's 
See? I, I'm fine now. Remember what I told you back in Ordon, Aster? When I grow up, I'm gonna be just like you. So you don't have to worry about me anymore. Go help Ilya. Leave the children to me. I'll watch over them, I swear it. Do not let their fates trouble you. Go to those who need you. In Hyrule, countless tales are told of the ancient hero, and your deeds bring them all to mind. May the graces of the great goddesses who shaped Hyrule bear you on your way. Jinx. There's Mallow off in the corner being edgy. Speaking of Mallow, uh, it's time for us to get uh, a couple of things. We get bombs, we get uh, two heart pieces, we get uh, the Hawkeye. Three heart pieces, actually, now that I think about it. Um, there's Barnes. Hey now, bud. How about this? Yep, I finally managed to get my numbers together and open up shop again. Well, sort of. Guess I've only got one type of bomb, but hey, that's one more than none, right? If only my storehouse had survived. Uh, yeah, if only. Um, but hey, it ain't as bad as all that. I'll add a few more types as we go. For now, have a look-see and see what we got so far. What's this now? You ain't got a bomb bag for carrying bombs, huh? Got a special offer going right now. My bomb bag premium kit, which comes with a bag and bombs. Just 120 rupees. I'll take it. Now you get to taste the true height of perfection with my finally crafted bombs. You can buy bombs and arrows. Thank you. I'll send you a letter with the details so you can read it at your leisure. You got a bag with bombs. Hooray. Hey, we're open 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, so you just drop on by anytime. Thank you, Barnes. Appreciate your assistance. Hello, Goron. Now we're able to go back into our mines, I was finally able to bring Barnes a new delivery of bomb ingredients, brother. Looks like you finally started selling them again. You should try out Barnes brand bombs sometime, brother. Say, hey, brother, if you ever want to get onto the top of the roof of the store, I can launch you up there. What do you say to that? Yes, please. That sounds like fun and not at all dangerous. Cool. And it was only a mild concussion. Great. Um, while I'm thinking about it, hold on one sec. Huh. That's interesting. Well, let me, uh, make bomb arrows right now. Oh well. Questions for later. I heard this town was also attacked by beasts and that it met with a terrible fate. Ha! Huh, I understood that reference. It's shameful that we were so concerned with ourselves that we did not even help them. I'm helping the little human up above keep watch to help relations between Kakariko Village and our people on Death Mountain. You want to check the view from up top? It's pretty amazing scenery, brother. Climb up on my back and take a look. I missed! Dang it. Hey, uh, brother, I need your help. <laughs> Thanks. There we go. What's up, Tallow? How you doing? Master, check me out. I'm up here keeping watch for the whole town. Yeah, any more monsters try to attack and I'm going to be ready. I'll shout my head off and warn everybody. Ah, gee, but if I had a bow, I could just sit up here and shoot all those nasty monsters. 
Oh, hey, I know, Astro. You can show me how to use one. Come on, please. Just show me how to shoot a bow, Astro, okay? I'm not lending you this one. Okay, Mal's down there in front of the spring, so go down and find him. Show me from there. He came. But can you really use a bow? I've never seen you so much as hold a bow back in Nordon. Whatever. First off, shoot through that. Easy. Oops. There we go. Hmm. Guess that one was a bit on the easy side. Fine. How about that? No. There we go. Hey! Up here! Try to hit this pole! I can only barely see it. Ha! Got it, though. Whoa, you hit it! You hit it! Thanks, Aster. I guess you have a little bit of skill when you concentrate. Looks like you've left some battles behind you. Impressive. Take this. Thanks. How unceremonious, but I appreciate it. Okay, give me just a minute here. Oh, there we go. Okay, I figured out how to use bomb arrows. Okay. Oops. That should get it. Sweet. Um, eh, whatever. Not like I'm really gonna run out of arrows very soon. I'm sure I'm bound to get more. Uh, interesting fact about this game. Hold on, let me activate it real quick. Yeah, if you hit the, uh, the cuckoos a bunch, instead of getting mobbed by them, you can actually control it for a bit. <laughs> I don't know why. But it, it's, ugh, it's so good. I love it. And it's only for a couple seconds, but that's, it's just a fun little thing. Uh, okay, so now, actually I shouldn't have done that. There we go. I could buy more arrows from Mallow's shop, but... Ugh, then I have to turn around and walk back, and I don't want to. Let's just go and get us, uh, another heart piece. Actually. Cool. Mr. Aster, wee! Wang! <laughs> Greetings, Mr. Aster. I've come to deliver a letter. There's a, there's a letter for you. Two letters, in fact. I'm gonna give this guy a different voice every time and not even realize it. Well, my business is concluded. Onward to mail! Sorry, just had to check the mail real quick. Oh, did that hit? Yay, it hit. Okay, good. Alright. This game is full of situations that would suck to actually be in. You got a piece of heart. You collected five pieces, new heart container, etc., etc. Hooray! Uh, I'm actually gonna save real quick. Okay. Um, there is, I believe, a pair of grasshoppers in the field here. I don't remember exactly where the one... Like, there's one by the bridge. But I don't remember where the other one is. It's not very far away. Let's 
feel like it was near one of these pools. Go away. Come on. There we go. Oh well. I'll come back for it later. If I'm blind and you can see it, uh, I apologize. Oop. I thought it was on the other side. Okay. Did I miss? I missed! A phasmid. Okay. should stop equipping or unequipping my bomb arrows. Uh-oh. Oi! Can you not steal the bridge, please? Well, great. Okay. Well... Let's go deal with them. Actually, let's not do that until we're a little closer. There we go. Lots of rupees. What's up, guys? No! Oh, that's not good. Oh, good. Okay. Woo! It's kind of afraid I screwed it up. But nope, we're good. Oh. Okay. Thanks for putting me way over here. So I can't grab the hearts in time. Whatever, it's fine. It's fine. We'll grab more later. Kind of running low on arrows. Man, if only there was a shop I could have stopped at to buy more. Mm. Oh well. I mean, it's not like I'm going to need them up ahead. So, whatever. Small potatoes. And I should be able to farm them here, so... Okay, cool. Done farming for arrows. Good. Okay, I mean, uh, she just refuses to go any further. And that's fair. <laughs> ah, we're finally here. There's only one few shadow left. So this is the last of the twilight you'll see, I guess. Whether or not you accomplish your final task and survive is up to you. <laughs> so what will you do? Want me to let you into the twilight? Yes, please. Alright. Alright then, I guess I'll have to help you. 
But what a shame this is the last of the twilight. I have become so fond of seeing it covering this world. What is it really the last you'll see? <laughs> so, shall we get going? Yes, but on the next episode. Uh, maybe I should have done it before we actually enter the twilight, but too late. Uh... <laughs> Uh, yeah, we'll uh, we'll get started on freeing the last of the twilight in the Lanayru region uh, on the next episode. I uh, I hope you enjoyed this one, and I look forward to seeing you on the next one. Till then.